It was in the month of November in 2016 that Embers uh, had come with their team and uh, they wanted to have a medical camp. They had two doctors with them and uh, one of the doctors was Lisa Singh. I decided to go to India because I had a desire to serve an underserved community and I have skills in healthcare as a physician so I thought I can use those skills to help people in need. I have Indian ancestry so I thought it'd be great to understand a little bit of my roots and understand what the people encounter there on a daily basis. We work with Pastor Guy because he knew the needs of the local community in the slums that did not have any access to medical services. And that day, we had over 300 people showing up to receive the medical service. When I started going to India, what I found was the sense of hopelessness from the youth and the children. And there is this very prevalent belief that once you are born into certain caste or certain family, you have to obey your destiny at birth. If you do not obey, then you will actually be born into a worse life in the next life. And because of this belief, um, a lot of children and youth are not able to dream for their future. Many of the youth that we serve they do not have the inspiration or the role model. They haven't seen anyone who is born from their community and have become, in a way, successful, achieving their dreams and living a flourishing life. The amazing thing that was happening with our brothers and sisters, they were amazed to see an Indian doctor there with the American team. When they got to know her name is Lisa Singh, they wanted to find out more about her. And they would all come to look at her inside the, the tent. And in that camp, Madhu was the translator for the foreign doctors. I do remember meeting her, uh, especially at that medical camp, and how willing she was to help, uh, how energetic and enthusiastic she was. Lisa did patients ke saath, uh, unko check karti thi, aur main unko translation karti thi ki kaisi goli khane ki hai ya kya ho raha hai aapko. To wo main Lisa didi ko batati thi. Madhu's father came to me, and then he said, uh, Pastor. Uh, I am really so happy to see an Indian doctor in uh, America. When I see her, I see my daughter. I mean, my father went and asked him to ask him to ask him or to ask him to ask him to ask him to ask him how good it is that our people go to the country, they go to the doctor and come back to the country to serve the people of the country. So, Papa said that how good it would be if I had four children in my house, I would be proud of myself and proud of myself. When I heard that story from Pastor Guy, I was overjoyed because we knew that our partners and ourselves too tried to instill that hope and dream for the youth and the children for a long time. And this was finally a moment of breakthrough. That was the moment that started this legacy education program. This program provides an opportunity for the youth and the survivors uh, to receive a higher education, creating an opportunity for the youth to pursue something much more than they can ever dream. But it so happened that uh, right after the camp in uh, 2017, he passed away. All the dreams that he had, it, it seemed that as if it was shattered. Madhu was totally broken because she was at her father's side when he was dying. She took all the blame on herself and she thought that she'll play the role of the father in the house to help the older sister and the younger siblings to uh, study. And then for that she had to give up her education. But when Embers came with their program, then I told them that it is this girl who I think in mind that she is correct fit for the program and praise God that they trusted her or, and then she really took up the challenge. Papa was a good job, but I was not so financially so good. I was in my house, I was just my papa to work for me. And the embers gave me a lot of help in the 12th, uniform and books and everything gave me a lot of help. और अभी भी पूरा एजुकेशन का जो फीस है, हॉस्टेल का फीस है, ट्यूशन फीस है, कैंटीन फीस है, सब पैसे का जिम्मेदारी एम्बेस ने मेरे उठाया आज तक। मैं 
मैं चाहती हूँ कि मैं सच में बेस्ट फीमेल सर्जन बनूँ और जब तक मैं बनूँगी ना मैं तब तक ट्राई तो करते ही रहूँगी कि हाँ उस 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 हद तक मैं पहुँचूँ अभी एन एम कर, कर चुकी हूँ जी एन एम के लिए अप्लाई करने वाली हूँ बी एस सी देखते प्रभु जैसे लेके जाएगा वैसे We have learned over the years that our presence matters. When we show up, a breakthrough can happen, and that breakthrough can lead to a dream, a dream that Madhu's father had. Dr. Lisa Singh's presence and faithful service became an inspiration to Madhu, and now Madhu has become an inspiration to all of our children at Sahasi Embers. And I know that there are many more Madhus out there. Many more Dr. Lisas out there, and the children and the youth that we serve, the survivors of trafficking that we support, we believe that their dreams can become reality, and they too can become an inspiration to many more future children. And we are so so hopeful and excited to see the dreams of our children becoming reality.